Welcome back, everyone. So you never know when an accident or broken down car could leave you stranded on the side of the road for an extended period of time. So during the winter, it's a good idea to keep a cold weather emergency kit in your car. So we've got survival mm -hmm. expert Tyler Weathers here from Trailblazer Survival School to show us what to pack and share some safety tips with us. So mm -hmm. hi, Tyler. Hi. Thanks for being here. All right, tell us what we got here. OK, so I put together what I thought would be mm -hmm. a great kit to keep in your car just to make sure you're mm -hmm. safe as can be, especially in the winter. OK, a lot of the items, though, you should just keep in your car at all times. Yeah. Um, starting down over here. So I put together, you see there's a tire compressor, there's mm -hmm. jumper cables, mm -hmm. these are uh, tire iron, your jack. Those are just basic things you always mm -hmm. want to have in your car. You never know what's going to happen to your vehicle, you never know what's going to happen to you, and you want to mm -hmm. just be able to mm -hmm. kind of fix your problems yourself. Okay, Wait, just a, yeah, yeah, me I was just, just a dumb was question. question, what's a tire yeah. compressor? <laughs> you and I were thinking exactly the same uh, thing. Just, uh -huh. uh, so let's say you get a flat tire, mm -hmm. uh, there's a little tool in here that puts mm -hmm. a little piece of rubber in your tire, mm -hmm. and then that'll inflate it with air. So, so you, you know what's really the good? Tire yeah, and you yeah. Can, okay. yeah, you can do it yourself. Um, I've, I've used that one to do that. Mm -hmm. It plugs into your cigarette lighter. And, and, and apparently this happens, you know, with, with this type of weather, right? Uh, tires. Uh, oh yeah, tires day. definitely yeah. go low. I don't know the science behind yeah. it, but yeah, getting a flat is a much more common thing in winter. Because I, um, my, my little light um, inflate your tires has come up. So yeah. having one of these actually might be helpful. Yeah, I, have, I haven't been able to, you know, stop somewhere to get my tires filled, yeah. but even, you know, that that could even help even in a non-emergency yeah, situation. Yeah, just in the morning when you come mm -hmm. out and your tires yeah. flat. I, I don't ever carry cash anymore, so just finding quarters to go fill my <laughs> car up is always a pain. Yeah. yeah. Um, what's cool though, so my sister just started driving. I bought her one of these for Christmas. All of these items, with the exception of a jack, mm -hmm. are typically in here. It's just yeah. a little road emergency kit. What, um, what can we buy something like this? You can buy this at Walmart, AutoZone, any of the car stores. They'll have something like this. It's got these cool things like, you know, if you pull over on the side of the road, you-, you Safety vest. Safety. It'll Very have some, important. Yeah, it'll have some road flares. Um, it's got a little bit set in it so you can do your own repairs. Mm -hmm. um, it's got the jumper cables. It even has in here a, uh, a tow cable. So let's say for some reason you're you're mm -hmm. just stuck on the side of the road. Mm -hmm. Someone can easily pull you out. Wow, mm. this is really great. I mean, I love it because I always see people on the side of the roads. I don't know if you've seen them here. Yeah. Yeah, and you know, having something like this would be a warning. You know that you know, letting someone know, I'm here. Yeah. <laughs> Please, you know, slow, slow, slow your roll, right? Yeah, and it's yeah. super important. When, like, so when we have conditions where our cars can mm -hmm. slide, mm -hmm. and let's say you were to accidentally slide off the road, mm -hmm. it's likely the next person coming is going to hit that same patch, have the same mm -hmm. problem, but this yeah. time your car might be there. Okay. So it's important to signal like that, even using yeah. a flashlight, and just make your presence, you no. know, really known. Interesting. Um, okay, so what else do we have? So I see some warm weather. Yeah, so, stuff. so. I mean, not warm weather. Cold, cold weather, weather stuff to but keep you yeah. warm in cold weather. That's what I meant. I love oh, it. So be yeah. Here you so, go, here's your gloves. Thank you. It's Tell one of the this. most important things for winter, and I know it's getting warmer now, but right. it's still really important. Put a, a winter set of clothes in your car. Okay. If for any re even if you have to just get out of your car for an extended period of time, you want to have warm clothes on you. I go to work a lot of times with short and t-shirt because I start in my warm house and I go to my warm job. Mm -hmm. But it's important to keep the extra clothes. Um, if you can't, okay. here's the coolest thing. These heat up uh, they're for 18 hours. They stay warm. Oh, I and love the some, hand warmers. You open yep. them, you just shake them, and, and they that's automatically. A, that's a really big one. It's a dollar. And then this is a dollar emergency blanket. If you needed some kind of winter survival uh, tool, those would be the ones to have. You can okay. put those in your clothes and wrap yourself up like a burrito. Okay. All right. <laughs> wrap yourself up like a burrito. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Um, we have less than a minute to go, so tell us what else we okay, got yeah. here. This is great stuff. Uh, so just okay. some final things. Never hurts to have food and water in your car. Water is a super easy one, you can, especially in the winter when you don't really need to worry about the plastic leaching. Mm -hmm. You can okay. stick it in your trunk. Obviously, if you need it, you got it. Um, and then finally, I would just say, uh, this is my little survival bag. Mm -hmm. I put a first aid kit. You never know if you're going to come up on a wreck or be in a wreck yourself. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. having just something like gauze um, can go a long way. Mm -hmm. okay. One very important thing to note uh, for the little kids out there, this is not for you, okay? <laughs> this, this uh, the water and yeah. the candy, because I, I, my 12-year-old will be it. all over there. I you know what it. I mean? Yeah. <laughs> He'd be the like in the back trying to get all this stuff. No, this is not. This is for emergency only. Yes. Yeah. This yeah. is great. Yeah. Great advice, Tyler. Well, this, is, this is wonderful and stuff. And even though mm -hmm. I feel like it's mm -hmm. we're in the 30s, 40s now, mm -hmm. if you are stuck, that is plenty cold outside yep. to need to have True. this gear with yeah. you. So. Yeah, it's not just for survival, it's for yeah. comfort, yeah. you know? Yeah, yeah, exactly. You run out of gas and guess what? Yeah. You don't have anything to warm you up, right? Yeah. But you do have your hat now and your gloves. Do yeah, you? yeah, <laughs> sounds good. You look like you're headed to North Dakota. Yeah, really. I love it. All right, All right Tyler, thank, thank, you. thank you so thank much. Thank you, guys. All right, well.